Recently, many iPhone users have complained that they are unable to update apps after the iOS 18 software update. If you have also run into this annoying problem, I have got you covered with some handy fixes. That said, let's get started. First off, I would recommend you to first create the App Store app and then try updating the apps once again. If the App Store is embroiled in some software glitches, it will help you resolve the problem right away. To do so, you just have to swipe up from the home bar to access the app switcher and then you have to swipe up the card of the App Store. And then you have to launch the App Store app and then find the app that you want to update and then go about the job as usual. Are you trying to update multiple apps at once on your iPhone? If the answer is yes, there is a decent chance that it might be coming in the way. So, I will suggest you to update one app at a time. Then, I will suggest you to enable disable the airplane mode. If your internet connection is sluggish, take advantage of the airplane mode trick to fix it. To do so, you just have to swipe down from the top right corner of the screen to bring up the control center. And then you have to tap on the airplane mode icon to turn it on. Now you have to wait for a few seconds and then tap on the airplane mode icon to disable it. When it comes to fixing the random iOS issues, Soft Reset has a pretty good track record. Therefore, I would suggest you to restart your iPhone. Another reliable solution that you should try is to update the software on your iPhone. There is a possibility that a software bug might be causing the app update issue. Thankfully, most iOS updates come with a ton of bug fixes and performance enhancements, so the software update will likely resolve the problem. To do so, we have to open the settings app on your iPhone. Then select General. After that, choose Software Update. And then you have to download and install the latest update as usual. If none of the tips has worked in fixing the app updating problem on your iPhone, I will recommend you to sign out of Apple ID and sign back in because this tip has worked for many users. To do so, you have to open the Settings app on your iPhone. Then you have to tap on the Apple ID banner at the top. Then you have to tap on the Sign Out option. And then you have to make sure to keep a copy of all the important data before signing out. And then you have to sign in using your Apple ID and password and try updating the app to check whether or not you have gotten the better of the problem. Hopefully, you have succeeded in fixing the problem and you are able to update apps as usual. If you found this video helpful, do like, consider it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and I'll just bye bye.